Hey guys, it's David here from Do You Even Game Bro. I'm here again with Kieran and Jordan. We were just playing Battlefront on the PS4. There was about, how many people? Was there about 40? 40 people playing on the land. It was great. Tell me what you thought about it, Kieran. Uh, I played it last night as well, and um, I was, I'm actually, it's growing on me a bit. I wasn't impressed last night, but I think it was a bit more fun today. I sort of knew the, objecti the objectives a little bit better. Um, it's a little, still a bit frantic though. It's not really cohesive. Uh, the the objectives that you've got, it felt like a bit like a, you know, like a bit of a, a shit fight. To it was a bit scattered at the to begin with. Like, yeah, I, I felt the same. I was like, uh, what am I doing? And it was like cannon fodder. Everyone was just kind of running in one direction. Yeah, that's it. But um, yeah, I managed to rack up a fair few kills. And I think if you want to go lone wolf, you can really in that game. Even though it's supposed to be about team play, if you just want to rack up a shitload of kills and sit back and feel the G's and kill people, it didn't seem to be a problem. Yeah, I found myself uh, grabbing a sniper and just hiding behind a rock. And uh, I was just like pot shotting pretty much <laughs> like wads and wads of uh, dudes just coming at me. I think I was playing a sword trooper. Who are you playing as? Um, um, the Re Rebel? I was playing as a really old dude when I got the, uh, the top. <laughs> what, what, you mean you playing or like oh, your yeah. character? I'm only 30. This guy was about 85, I reckon, because when it zoomed out, he was just the oldest dude. And then, yeah, you because know, I was in the, the TIE Fighters and you get to have a view of your character. And, um... So you got to actually fly the thing. How was the flying mechanics like? Oh, I had to change it to non-flight controls, as in inverting on the, on the right thumbstick, but... I crashed into the ground almost immediately. I suck at that sort of thing. That was you. But the ATATs, they're cool, and the ATSTs, they dominate. Yeah. Those power-ups on the field. And uh, John, I was playing next to you. You look like you were dying a lot. What did you thought? <laughs> ah, I'm I'm really good at dying. I'm um, pretty much even in Destiny. I'm really good at dying. But um, I had a blast playing. I mean, to be honest, I didn't expect much because it's a dice in EA game. I expected it to be a massive paywall. You know, so I pretty much got exactly what I expected. And, you know, I'm happy with it. I wouldn't pay for it, but I'm happy with it. I suppose we'll see how things turn out uh, in terms of game mechanics. Is there anything you'd say at uh, kind of tie off? Um, well, I'll be reviewing the game when it comes out along with uh, Taylor Jeffrey. So watch out for that. Um, I'll definitely be having a red hot go at it. Uh, I'm looking forward to it more so than I was when I played it last night. I think it'll grow on me. Uh, I just hope the maps uh, aren't as sparse as the one we played because it felt a bit plain the one we had. There was just... There was like one base it could go in. I know it's hot, so it's pretty plain, but I feel like they could have been a little more creative with the environment. Yeah, well, the forest looks cool. The yeah, forest that we've seen in other videos looks cool. Yeah. The forest looks awesome, and because it's heat to cover to play behind, you, like, the, the, the gameplay may not be so frantic in that map, but like, I feel like there was so much more chaos on that hot map because there was just non, not anything to hide behind. I find it interesting, uh, I thought I'd uh, be a lone wolf, as you say, and uh, I was in the middle of the open. Yeah, but I had this at t kind of like pushing me, like running me over, but like pushing me into the battle. So there's some things that kind of like took away, uh, took me out of the like the realism of it for a bit. But look, like an invisible wall you're being pushed. Yeah, by the at t oh. though. Like the at t was like stepping down, but kind of like pushing me as opposed oh, to killing right. me. Yeah, so we'll see. It's so, uh, yeah, I, I, we'll see how it goes. I think after a few uh, patches and a few bugs, it might maybe iron those things out but look we'll see we'll, we only played for what 10 minutes so yeah it was good all right well that's that's again from us at uh, the eb expo in sydney 2015 i'm david with jordan uh, with jordan and kieran thanks for your time guys we'll see we'll see you guys at the uh, the next game i suppose i'll be there <laughs>